Food Tech Summit, an international celebration of innovation and technology, has kicked off in Palace Grounds this week. Now in its 22nd edition, the conference and exhibition have international participation from 22 countries. The conference agenda features a wide range of topics. 5G, industrial IoT, deep genomics, ethical artificial intelligence, smart agriculture and many more. Mechanisms and frameworks of superclusters, industry competitiveness, drone regulations and bilateral cooperation are also on the agenda. Chief Minister B.S. Yadurapa said Karnataka is moving towards becoming an innovation hub, a gradual shift from the services sector to product development. The setup is quite tremendous, it's amazing. Uh, this is something what I actually expected and what I had in mind. Was usually a good for uh, things in you, your story, but this is quite even better. And the people would have actually been seeing since morning. It's quite worth it actually. It's quite the journey. I see new innovations over here. Uh, some things actually picked, and it's quite on top of my mind. It's amazing. Basically, an agriculture drone which can carry around 10 liters of pesticide for agriculture spraying. It can also carry growth promoting nutrition liquid also. So to address uh, labor issues, all those things, this agricultural drone is extremely helpful and uh, it can spray uniformly and we have a rudder, terrain following rudder, so that if there is any uh, terrain region or hill region, it can easily adjust the altitude. And since we have GPS, it can fly automatically. So auto takeoff and auto landing, which will be extremely simple and helpful for the farmers. The three-day summit will provide a platform to encourage discussion on disruptive technologies. It also features multi-track conferences and international exhibition, global innovation alliances, robo-recharge workshops, etc. With meeting of such minds, it does give the state and the city a good reputation and a good boost for its future as the Karnataka government mulls over setting up a technology development board.